What's up guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we have some Mosaic Basketball. These are the cello packs, retail of course, that I have not tried yet. And they come with these exclusive pink camo prisms. I um, I actually call these hanger packs. I understand there's a hanger box now and they're officially called cellos, but I've always called these hangers or rack packs or fat packs. So um, yeah, cello is like something that's very forced for me. I don't, I don't say that naturally, but I have four of these. That's all I was able to get. They dropped early at Walmart a while back, and I've been sitting on these. Um, never had a chance to post them, but we're finally going to do these now. And I think they retail for maybe 10 to 12-ish, I want to say, but I'm not sure. Once again, I paid resale for these and all my mosaics. So, um, yeah, but this is what we do have for these. So I think we should have, I think each one comes with three packs, so it might be 12 packs, but I'll have to look at these closer. But anyway, 15 total cards inside, and let's take a closer look at these. So Zion, of course, the hobby boxes are crazy expensive. I I cannot believe how much those were selling for because it, it just doesn't make sense. It's it's not a lot of sense behind that, but they do sell for a lot. I don't even think I tried to get it. I just saw the ending price, but it's crazy money. But um, yeah, that's the world we live in now. There's 15 cards, three pink camo prisms. So I would assume six, six, and three. Yeah, just like the, I believe, the regular prism ones so um yeah nice stuff overall uh let's see what do we have here very small i don't know if this is going to focus here let's see this is all the stuff we can find in here actually it does focus there we go so as you can see we have tons of parallels all these nice ones um blue for fluorescent number two what is that 15 yeah 15 then our regular retails stuff like that pretty sweet so there's all the stuff we can find and let's get into the actual ripping of these packs mosaic is a is a nice looking product i definitely don't think it's on the tier of prism or optic but it's a nice looking product which makes no sense that if optic hobby boxes go for like a few hundred less than mosaic but optic is definitely by far the better product um i don't know don't really get it but we have Zion, that's actually from Optic here. So this is the My House one. Love this card. So sweet. Look at that. And then um, that was one of my better retail pulls. And we also have that Jaw Mosaic, which you guys have seen recently. So really nice. Let's hope we can pull a Zion Mosaic or a Zion Fluorescent. Who knows? I think I usually open these like this. There we go. But let's uh, hope for some good luck. We will have, we do have an ongoing football break. I don't know uh, at the current point in time what the exact details are, but you guys will know by the time, because I will have posted details. I'm recording this before all the finalization of that. So we'll see what happens. Uh, I think there is no purchase necessary information here. I don't know how that works, but I always get questions about this. So here you go. Don't know how to do that myself, but some of you guys do. So good luck for that. And let's get into this pack. Be careful with that corner. All right, let's take a look. So we have hit good stuff in Mosaic. We personally have had good luck, but it wasn't exactly for us. Now, obviously, we pulled that job, but if you guys saw my second basketball break, you'll know we went we went nuts. We pulled so many Zions. If you haven't seen that break, check that out. But that was a crazy, crazy break. So uh, hopefully there's some Zions left for us. Dwight Howard here. Nice. And then we have Seth Curry. We have Troy Brown Jr. and then a green will to win Jokic and a Bruno Fernando. So there you go. I would imagine the next one will be a silver or a mosaic because usually I think with the uh, with the prism ones there was one green and one silver. Obviously mosaics don't exist in in um, prism, so I, that option wasn't there. But I would assume we get one or the other. We have a Derek White. We have a Andrew Wiggins. And Alec Burks, Andre Drummond Green, so maybe, maybe not. We have Braun, Will to win, always good to get Braun, and Patrick Ewing. So nothing too crazy so far, but that's okay because we'll hit Zion here. All right, let's see. Coos. So I guess that's the pink camos. Kind of tough to see because of the pattern, but yeah, there's a little camo pattern. It looks just plain pink through the camera, but 
it is kind of like a camo pattern really tough to see because these are way crazy flashy like very very bright cards but kuzma grayson allen come on let's get one rookie bobo all right we'll take that we'll take we'll take bobo all right so one down one solid bobo interesting to see how his career pans out All right, next pack. We have a Luca on the back. Got Lavert, Van Vliet, Devin Booker, Brogdon. No parallel in this one. Kawhi and uh, Luca. So, hmm, interesting. One of these weren't parallels. Yeah, wow, so just a bunch of face. Yay. <laughs> oh, that stinks that you don't get a parallel per pack. I would assume you should. Even if it's just one of those more common green ones. Speaking of the common green ones. Derek Rose. Mellow. CP to the three. Uh, oh! <laughs> yes! <laughs> there we go! Complaining you shall receive. <laughs> no, I'm definitely a happy man. There we go. Zion has landed. And that's the base. That is the base. Na, 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 na. I am a happy guy. Woo. Zion. Hello there, old friend. Green. I always, always recommend cutting this corner now. I know that some people say you don't need to do it. I 1 million percent believe you must do that because you never want to cut, kind of nip those corners. Even if you don't think you nipped them, you can nip them and it uh, takes a toll on those cards. All right, nice Zion here, kind of move it down. It's kind of loud, sorry guys, but I want to get it at the bottom of the top loader. There we go, Zion. Someone has to go. Is it Zion or is it Ja or is it Instagram has to go? Pac-Man cards, check it out if you haven't already, where we post a lot of pictures of cards, give you guys early info, all that fun stuff. So Zion's in the back. Everything else is just icing on the cake. Let's see what we can get. We got our guy. I wanted one of those bad because if you guys don't know, I don't have any Zions. Despite pulling three million Zions in that break, I don't have one for myself. All right. Contavious Caldwell, not rookie. Gordon Havet and Charles Vetley. That's actually a nice one. I like this Charles. We'll put all our parallels here for now. Next one. Two more of these left. I don't know how much more I could expect after that nice Zion. We got our Bubble. Excellent name. All right, let's see. Not too often do I, I just realize, see the... the cover art of whoever you know, the athlete is, in this case Zion, is also his picture they use in the card. You don't see that too often. Giannis Antetokounmpo, although I feel like this year they've kind of just used the same pictures of Zion and Ja for like every card. Um, Aiton is a good guy right there. A lot of, this is just like the first one, Sean Kemp and Cody Martin. So not a lot of stuff in that one, but maybe there's Zion in this one because we didn't get any parallel. All right, another green, if we didn't have enough of those already. Got our vets. A Kendrick Nunn. Oh, ah, Carl Anthony Towns. I saw M for Miami Heat, I saw K for Kendrick. I was like, oh, no, Carl Anthony Towns, good player, PG and VC. Oh, almost skipped this guy. All right, let's get our guy jaw let's do it all right who is this jabari parker uh, wendell carter jr uh, oh Giannis mvps that's a good card i'll def definitely take that card anything Giannis is good i mean base cards 
hollows, silvers. If it's Giannis, it's good. That's that's kind of the card collecting rule. see what we got here. Can we get a parallel in this first pack? No parallel. So, interesting. Only the first one had uh, two parallels. All the other ones had one. You'd think we'd at least get two. Old school magic and a uh, weather spoon. So, hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Not too sure I love that. Is this Kendrick Nunn? Is that a debut or is that a regular one? Definitely want the regular ones. And our regularly scheduled green, Curry, Luke, uh, oh, uh, Jokic and Paul George. And Jason Richardson and Kendrick Dunn debut. All right, put these here. Last pack. Once again, we already got what we came here for. So everything else is a bonus. Although a rookie wouldn't hurt. Mason Plumley. Uh huh. Uh uh. Alfred Payton. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. Okay. Katie. I'll take that. That's solid. So, solid break overall, to say the least. I am happy. The packs overall, mm, they weren't the greatest. We we got lucky, but we didn't hit too much crazy stuff, other than that one. If that Zion, which was definitely you know, you get that not as. Uh, Often as you would you think, but you don't get too much other than that. You only get one or two parallels, and then a bunch of the base ones, and you know maybe Zion, Ja, go for a decent amount. But other than them, you know, kind of relying on those pinks and and look at this, the bend on this card. Jeez, up in here. If if I didn't know any better, I would have thought that pack had like a, a jersey card in it. It's so big. Anyway. KD was a good one. I don't know how he made the set. Um, Giannis, that's that's definitely a good one. Can't complain about the Giannis. Charles Barkley, I like that. Bull Bull, so pinks were all right. Nothing too crazy except for these two, but obviously we know what was, what was the big card. And that is this one right here. Zion, green. Pretty cool card. Nice uh, action, I guess action shot, not from the rookie premiere. I like it. Really good looking card. Centering looks solid. I'm sure I'll find some other issue with it once actually a little closer, which always ends up being the case. But I'm I'm so happy. I love this card. It's a good one. My first Zion from Mosaic. And uh, this one will be added to my nice little Zion collection. So that'll do it for this one. I wanted to review these. Finally happened. Uh, if you haven't gotten them yet and you're curious as to what they are like, well, there you go. It's kind of like that. And um, yeah, solid format overall. Mosaic, I think, is starting to come out much, much more. The factories are open. They're starting to... Once again, mass produced these a lot, so you'll see a lot more mosaic coming out. Hobby boxes are crazy money, but retail should should be there. Kind of to an extent that Prism and Optic were there. You know, people find them, buy them all, resell them. But good luck. Hopefully you can find some. Hopefully you can rip some and pull some nice cards. And um, that'll do it for this video. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.